Hi everyone, it's Tim Stump from Technique Peak. Uh, today I'd like to demonstrate a technique that we use in the clinic quite often called eccentric scaption. Uh, we all know the benefits of eccentric training and the effects that it has on degenerative tendons. A lot of uh, research in the literature showing it on Achilles tendons, ECRB, uh, and also patellar tendon. But very little evidence is shown uh, in the research when it comes to the supraspinatus tendon, which is the most commonly uh, degenerative tendon of the rotator cuff uh, and most commonly repaired. So today we'd like to show you how we can uh, utilize that uh, eccentric strengthening in this exercise. So what Donis is going to do is we're going to choose a weight the primary limitation is what the person can lower, okay? So remember, we're gonna use a very light weight, maybe one to two pounds heavier than what they would be using when they do scaption. So you put them in the scapular plane, Donis is gonna press up overhead to basically self-spot or get that weight into the position, and then under a five second lowering phase, he's gonna slowly lower, so we're implementing the time under tension principle to affect the, the rotator cuff, and then when he gets it all the way down, again, he's going to repeat, shorten the lever arm. We're maintaining the scapular plane the entire time. And then he's slowly lowering. And many of you, you know, obviously, the idea is that you have to have full range of motion to do this. One of the benefits of working overhead is that you're going to uh, get this uh, serratus anterior involved more when it's over 90 and also the lower traps. Plus, you're getting a little bit more practice in uh, queuing up the person or the patient with scapular humeral rhythm issues. Try that again. Press, and then slowly lower. You can give the person tactile cues to see how they're doing, see if the scapula is winging. This is something that we use in the clinic, and hopefully you'll find this helpful in treating your patients. Thank you. <laughs>